Everton have made the early running in the transfer market, spending around 25 to 30 million pound on Michael Keane, 30 million on Jordan Pickford, and 24 million on Ajax's Davy Klassen, as well as smaller deals for Henry Onyekuru and Sandra Ramirez. Keane was part of a Burnley defence who conceded fewer goals than anyone else in the bottom half save Middlesbrough. As several writers, including Mark Thompson, have shown, Burnley had a very well-drilled blocking system, covering the posts and protecting Tom Heaton. As such, Ben Mee and Keane were the two most prolific blockers in the Premier League last season. Keane was the fifth best player for blocks per 90 minutes of anyone who made five or more blocks as well. He was 16th for clearances per 90 of players who made 10 or more, behind me again as it happens, and also behind two Everton defenders, Phil Jagielka and Ashley Williams. Jagielka, though, is surely of an age where he should be a squad player at most. Indeed, while Keane's metrics for headed clearances and tackles won are not shabby either, one wonders whether Everton might have bought the wrong centre-back. Take a look at Keane and me compared, like for like, across the main defensive data points. Nonetheless, even if Ben Mee has better stats and is left-footed, which could complement Ashley Williams as well, Michael Keane is a proven Premier League player and three years younger than his erstwhile Burnley colleague, so Everton have bought well. And what of the Toffees' acquisition at the other end, David Klaassen? Klaassen scored 14 goals for Ajax, second only to Kasper Dolberg, and 18% of Ajax's total haul of 79. Of the top nine goal scorers in the Eredivisie, Klassen has the lowest goals per 90 of any. Nonetheless, his overall creativity was crucial, setting up Dolberg for three goals and assisting at a better rate than all but two of the top nine goal scorers. Indeed, Klassen was joint fifth for assists in the Eredivisie overall, although with the lowest assists per 90 of those seven players who assisted nine times or more, Klaassen's 1.8 shots per 90 and 1.8 key passes per 90 are good, but not exemplary in Eredivisie terms. But as a deeper-lying playmaker who could work well in a midfield axis alongside Idrissa Gay, and who weighs in with goals, Klaassen is a good buy. Everton's transfer policy looks so far to be solid. Pickford is another strong addition, and Ramirez, who top-scored with 14 for Malaga despite being 21, looks to be a very astute bit of business. Me might have been a better buy than Keane, but Keane is still a fine centre-back. Everton's assault on the top four has begun well.